Any specific reason why you grew out here? Is this on video? A rebellion. Just trying to be rebellious? Against COVID. I, I started when COVID kicked in. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. He's rebellious. He's hairy. He even loves all moms across the world. Your mom. <laughs> now, Troy has come to us, boys and girls, because it's time. It's time to let all this go. But there's something that we have to keep in mind. He's got a problematic area. He has a little happy spot here, right here on the crown. I know this. No matter what it looks like, it's going to feel good. Would you grow it out this this uh, extreme again? Ooh, that was a commitment, bro. That's why I said when I did it, that was probably it, right? And I'll be honest with you, back when I used to get my hair cut every two weeks, that was like the highlight of my month, bro. Or the two, I went to the barber shop, love it. I walk out feeling like a million bucks. Now you already know what we're doing, guys. And for the ones that don't know what we're doing, we're just creating a perimeter using block graduation. It's not always something that I go for when I get started with haircuts that I do maintenance on. For example, maintenance meaning they come to me every like two to three weeks. Troy here, guys, remember, he's a rebel. He, he wanted to go beyond that. He wanted to go ahead and show the world that he's not playing around. And when you have a Troy come to you, sit on your chair, let you know, hey, it's been about two plus years since I've done this. You know, you treat that client a little different. You treat that Troy treat that troy a little different and i like to use that opportunity to also you know put this sheer work to to practice put the put the proper techniques into into play i have been using six and a half inch shears for the past six months i believe but recently your boy got five and a half and i was told that you know it's not a big difference boy let me tell you i enjoy five and a half inch shears i highly recommend them but your mom now remember guys troy's got a little happy spot and we have already created a perimeter we're just cleaning that perimeter up a little bit more with the number four guard before we come back with the number two the number two is what he wanted as a base but a two is as low as i've ever cut him before but then you know the shutdown happened and uh troy betrayed me like i said i used to be a regular and then he became a traitor not only did he did he stop coming here he went to a salon one time look it's like i'm not you think i'd ever go to a salon for a fade heck no Or you just want to take like about an inch off. What? You're the pro, bro. Whatever you think is gonna look best. But I, you know, we want to get slim it down. I like a nice squareness to it if we can get it. I know my beard's a little wiry, so you're the you're the pro, bro. guys if you want to know or see a lengthier video with details on how i cut troy troy right there you see him you see him make sure you go on the 245 academy i'm going to break down in detail how i went about the service i'm going to make sure i leave the link on the description click on it i'll see you there
All you gotta do is put a 12-pack sword line outside that year. That's the truth right there. I got a little more class than that, dude. I drink out of the bottle. <laughs> So after the beard has been perfectly dried, guys, we're gonna come back and shape it up. Not too much off, even though he gave us complete freedom with whatever we wanted to do. Our artistic abilities could have reached beyond the stars on this one, guys. But sometimes simple is enough. And for Troy, in my mind, in my head, my imagination, I don't see Troy with a short beard. Do you? So I just felt like, Yes, Troy, I understand you're giving me freedom, but at the same time, I'm pretty sure your friends and your loved ones appreciate you with a beard. You look better with this freaking long behind Duck Dynasty as beard. Now this mustache we have here, guys, I know what you're thinking. Most of you don't even like having mustaches this long or trim mustaches this long, but there are a group of men that appreciate a bushy freaking mustache. As a matter of fact, there are women that appreciate that a man has a bushy mustache. Yeah. Oh, I just moved your camera, bro. keep it nice let's keep it clean guys let's keep it classy even though what is not classy when you line up a beard all all beards are classy you know what but for this particular approach for troy's lineup i'm just taking a little bit off i'm not pushing this lineup too down to have the most sharp line because then takes away from the integrity of the beard so don't push them down especially when they have low density guys it's clear and the other struggle that i'm helping you with Troy is that happy spot. Remember that happy spot, boys and girls? See how it's not as loud as it was when we started with Troy? We want that happy spot to be happy, but we also want Troy to be happy. And Troy being happy is way better than the happy spot being happy. <laughs> Too, bro. I'm gonna schedule something for about two weeks because now I gotta keep going. So. Be here, bro. All right, thanks, thanks again, again, bro. <laughs>